great deal. This is the last of the good stuff, boss. I know. Some of those bottles I've had for 10 years. But we gotta make payroll. Get it out of here. Convert them. Load it up. Good to see you, boys. Boss, any word on a job I pulled with Salvatore? You did fine, Tom. Galati's got nothing on us now. We bought some time. At least until the money runs out. Don't go selling off the farm yet, boss. Sam says you worked out an angle. Yeah. And you're gonna love it. We make a few bucks and knock out a couple of Morello's teeth, too. Okay, what's the rumpus? A couple of weeks ago, I'm relaxing in the cigar lounge at the Blue Tropics. Where? Some small-time whorehouse. It's just a couple of closets with some mattresses on the floor. It's a gentleman's club. They got a bar and everything. <laughs> Anyways, one of the Johns is south. And he's crying to the madam about all his troubles. He catches my ear on account of his goofy accent. He's going on and on about how he just landed this huge payday. But the goons he's working for are already twisting his arm. And he's got the busted nose to show for it. You pick up his tab? Hell no. But I walked him out of the place, took him to the diner around the corner to sober up. We get to talking. Turns out his name is Gates. He's this hick up from Kentucky. Moonshiner? Uh-uh-uh. Better. Pop's got a couple of real distilleries, and I'll give you one guess as to their exclusive buyer around these parts. Morello. And you think he wants to burn bridges? Oh, yeah. I've been working him steady, boss. He's bringing up another shipment tonight, but he's got his entire crew ready to roll over. All we gotta do is make it look like a proper heist. I don't know, Polly. You really trust this guy? He's got no love for Morello, I'll tell you that. Not like we got a lot of options here. Mm. We'll be cutting up the last bean pretty soon, boss. What do you think, Tom? We need to replace the Canadian. If Polly says this Gates can do that, I'm in. Where's the meat? The big parking garage downtown. Okay, do it. But you better not be playing grab ass this time. You take Carlo and little Bill with you. Sure thing, boss. Once you have the truck, drive it back here. We won't let you down, boss. Don't make me regret giving you some time out there in the streets with the guys, Carlo. You don't have to worry about me. I know I don't. Tommy does that for me. I'll keep your driver safe, boss. Bona fortuna, boys. Sam and little Bill said to meet him downtown. Oh, I'm going too. Okay. I did not know that you were going to give me a different mission. Go, boys. I just want to see, like, okay, Carlo? I've been curious from the beginning, like, are we yourself. actually going to become, like, uh, a well-off mafia before the end of this game? Because it looks like if we just Listen, went from, like, eh, spend more time to with worse. Time all put together. <laughs> sure. Sure. I'm not talking Sound morality, I'm talking about, like, money. With his broad. <laughs> Success. Like, we haven't actually achieved being a, a decent, want me to come, I too good it's mafia fine. right now. Boss doesn't have to know. Nah, you coming. The boss said you're coming. Just, you got a face like you're being taken for an airing. I don't want Gates thinking we're frails. Why is Gates sour on Morello anyways? First time Gates pulled in with his trucks, Morello decided to change up the terms. The big guy himself popped him in the nose as part of their renegotiation. His nose is gonna get more in a pop if Morello hears we're involved. That's why we're pretending to stick him up. Then he'll go back to his pop and tell a sob story about being robbed at gunpoint. He'll convince his old man that Morello can't protect the merchandise. They'll need to find a new buyer out here, and he's heard of a stand-up guy named Salieri. This plan is some bullshit, Tom. Polly told it to me yesterday, and somehow it's gone worse. Hey, when you get a lead for the boss, and you don't just drive him places, then, then you get to pick holes. Till then, Shut your damn mouth. <laughs> uh, helps you sleep. When Morello tracks you down, don't come crying to me. You serious? You actually serious? Fellas, knock it off. Christ. <laughs> it's funny. Let's speed up a little bit. We got no cops in sight. I'll get ready for the L just in case. 
Oh god, gotta itch my arm. There we go. I like feel like I'm constantly having my eyes on the mini map when I'm driving. Oh shit, uh <laughs> oh sweet <laughs> that's why you don't read or text and drive um it kind of just happened honestly no. like Wait i wouldn't Dangerous driving on Central Island. i wouldn't even say he's risen up the ranks too high right now either like he he's just kind of here right now i wouldn't say he's really that high up right now I do a lot of deals here. Oh no. He kind of just fits though. in now is the best Always term I'd say. Shop till I'm done. Okay, we're good. Gates is waiting up it also did floor. like a, a few time skips because it was 1930 when it started. Now it's 1933. So it doesn't really show every single thing that happens. Uh, between 1930 and 1932 to 3, they just roughed up people and, you know, protection money just constantly did that. <laughs> I really shouldn't talk and drive, should I? <laughs> but they just had, you know, Which slow work. So Only people with cars so are people trust, with I guess. Nine to five, place is deserted. Well, we got jobs and we're here. That kind of a job, sure. Yeah, so it kind of just time skipped, like I said, like a few years, Anything and then it was like, oh yeah, nothing much really happened during these years. We just kind of, you know, had fun and worked together. Our kind of guy. And then there's the in-between that you missed from, you know, that point to now, where you Arc popped in. Polly! Good to see you, pal! Yeah, you too, Gates. Well... I hope you all have good taste in whiskey. I ain't really the expert here. Tommy! Oh, yeah, it's fine. Your first payment. If the Don's impressed, he'll finance more runs. And each one's gonna be bigger than the last. We're all gonna be rich, boys. Well, we are always happy to do business with good folks like Don Salieri. Please, give him my regards. Sure thing. Now we just gotta conclude this transaction. <laughs> No, no! It's okay. Oh, what? I told you we gotta make it look like a proper robbery. Damn thing's gonna be crooked by the time I'm done with this city. Ah, uh, don't worry, pal. With all the dough you're raking in, you're gonna be able to pay for a new one. <laughs> Watch out! Yeah, that doesn't make sense. Hey, over here. That definitely makes sense. Drop the mouth. How the hell do they know about this? Because you always shoot your mouth off. Gates took a bullet. This ain't as bad as it looks. Now take the booze and get. My guys will come for me. No, go, go, go! So long as you guys clear him out up ahead, I'll be safe here with the little guy. Carlo, in the cab with me. You know you stead. Tommy, check for more of them. This thing ain't over. Come on, I'll back you up! Okay, fine, fine. Escort the- Oh, yeah, because I'm going to be shooting. Gotcha! Oh, wait, no, no, no. Excuse me, one sec. Wait, 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 wait! Don't run over again, I need that! There we go. Wait up! Wait, slow, slow down! Please, no, stop! Stop, I need, I need to go. Okay, there we go. We got more of them. Woo! Get wrecked, asshats!
Good. Give me that health, please and thank you. Yeah, see, you jumping from chapter one to here, it would definitely see like a huge like probably leap in like his character development. But uh, no, for me at playing through it, it just kind of felt smooth, you know. Uh, other than the two year skip or three year skip from thirty to thirty three or thirty two, that time period it did feel like I would say kind of forced because you didn't actually get to experience it. I got you. Um, but I don't know how to get in here. Is there like a door I'm missing? I, I don't know how to get in here. Ow! Ow! What? Okay. Um, guess I was too close to the fire. What? I don't know how to. G oh, okay. Aha. The door on the side. Gotcha. Yeah, wasn't it? Ah! Ah! What? I thought I had a lot of ammo for the Tommy gun. Yeah, I know, right? I thought I was safe because I wasn't standing in the fire, but, you know, Tommy just can't handle the heat, apparently. Me, you bitch! Oh, you think you're cool, huh? Yeah, what? Oh, that way. Ammo! No, th th that's grenades. Holly! Come on! I, I did it! Okay, I got this. Let me switch to my pistol. I'm out of ammo. Oi! I saw something in between the truck. This is classic. The hardest difficulty is classic, not hard. If you look at the uh, difficulties and you can put them together, this one is definitely the uh, clear-cut winner. Ugh. We are? Then let me go get my Tommy gun. Don't hit me, please. I'm just, I'm just trying to get ammo. I, I got no ammo. Okay, guys, seriously, I need more ammo. Yeah, classic is the hardest difficulty you can put on because of how it's set up. I also have simulation mode turned on for police and for driving. Oh, I saw it! Oh, I thought there was somebody there. Grab a set of wheels and watch my back. Sure, Sam. Damn, it's already how damaged. How did Morello hear about my deal? All kinds of beefers in this city. For now, let's get the booze back to the warehouse and try not to die. Bro, you're gonna damage the fucking vehicle before you even get shot at. I do it. We got more guys on us. Okay. Yeah, we yeah we don't got time. Hit him where it hurts. Dude, 
we ain't gonna fucking survive. No! <laughs> Man, I knew we weren't gonna survive. Give us health for the truck, please. Through this loading screen, a mighty mafia god. From the Godfathers from TV shows. Yes! How the uh. hell did Morello hear about my deal? All kinds of beefers in this city. For now, let's get the booze back to the warehouse and try not to yeah. die. I like playing games on the hardest difficulty because it gives me a sense of achievement and worth. I knew it! We got more guys on us! Okay, let's slow them down some. Get them where yeah, they bitch! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, we're good, we're good, yeah. Now the cars are actually pretty brittle. It just depends where you uh, where you are hitting them. If you hit the engine, it'll fucking die fast. Happened to me earlier in the game. Uh, you'll see it when you eventually watch it, since you said you're gonna keep up on the older ones. Morello sent more guys after us. Another motor coming after the boost truck. The only ones that are like I think it's like during these missions, do uh, vehicles get more uh, tanky? Oh no! They're backyard! Oh shit. <laughs> I feel bad for their <laughs> place. Oh, nope. Can't take a break. Yeah, shut their tire out. And I shot their engine. Oh, that was a police officer. I'd have to say, yeah, out of everything, I think the cars are probably the most tanky thing out of the game. As you've seen, uh, the shooting aspect, the, the gunplay is uh, the hardest aspect for me. <laughs> because like you've seen, you can die really fast. I think we lost them all. I think it's like Thank one Christ shot with a shotgun, that. dude. Let's head home. See what we got. We got the booze. I mean, I know it didn't go to plan, but we got the booze. Yeah. So tonight, me and you are gonna drink a bunch of it. I guess we earned that much. <laughs> Looks like a 38. Morello's boys caught up with you? Yeah, boss. We took care of it. What about the kid from Kentucky? Uh, he took a slug to the shoulder. But, uh, he's a tough blocker. He and his crew dusted out as soon as we bumped off Morello's hatchet, man. Getting shot will give Gates and his pop another reason to ice Morello out of the whiskey business. Well, let's see if this hooch was worth all the trouble. Excellent. I'll work out the details with Papa Gates. But once we're running this Kentucky Brown, we'll be back in brass buttons. Good work, son. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of all of you. Saludo. Saludo. I don't have anything to cheers. I feel left alone. I feel left out.